If you clicked on this video, then that means you're probably playing Fortnite in docked mode using an extender cable, trying to actually get the mic and audio to work so you can play Fortnite with your friends or maybe complete strangers and the mic is not working. You probably have audio, but no mic. Well, there's a very simple solution to this, so just keep watching and I'll tell you how to fix it. Hey guys, Van Buren 20 back again, and with Fortnite on the Nintendo Switch comes something that we have not seen yet, and that's native voice chat. Yes, we have voice chat on the Nintendo Switch, but Nintendo tries to force you to use their app, and you gotta use a phone, and you get, there's a bunch of wires, and it's a complete and utter mess. A lot of people were like, why can't we just plug in you know, some headphones with a mic and just have voice chat? Well, with Fortnite, Epic actually made that possible. So now we have voice chat. So it's pretty exciting to see where the future is going to lead for the online gaming with Nintendo because now we know it's possible. There's no more excuses. Nintendo, we have voice chat. You don't need the app. You don't need all that nonsense. So let's go ahead and stop with all that crap and just give us the voice chat the way it's supposed to be. So if you're watching this video, you probably are like me and you're playing in docked mode. You put in your headphones and you're actually, you know, the headphones that I have that I'm using are just the standard cheap headphones that actually came with my phone. They're just some earbuds that have like a mic dangling on the cord. They're really, really super cheap. They're not high quality at all, but it actually works really well. Surprisingly, it works really good. The mic works good. Everyone can hear me just fine. But at first I was using an extender cable, right? You take an extender cable, you know, I actually have two of these. That way you can plug it in the, you know, on your Nintendo Switch while it's docked. So I can sit on the couch or the recliner and um, it did not work. I had audio but the mic unfortunately did not work. And I did some research and I was like, you know what, what if I just plug, you know, you know, the headphones right into the switch and don't use the extenders. That's what I first did. And it worked, the mic works. So I was like, okay, so it has something to do with the extension cord. So on, upon further expression, uh, expection of the extender cord, if you look closely, I don't know how well you guys can see if the camera's gonna focus in or not. I don't know well how well you guys can see trying to hide my face but there are two rings on the tip of this extender cord. I don't know how well you guys can see that, but there's two black rings. It might be white depending on your uh, whatever cord you got. But if you actually look at your headphones, it actually has three. Let me see how well you guys can see this. There's actually three. You see that? There's three white rings. So I'm like, wait a minute, there's three rings. There's only two rings on the cord. So what you got to do is you actually got to go to the store and buy an extension cable that has three rings on it. So those are channels from what I found out. Every ring is a channel. So you got two, which has two channels, one for the left audio, one for the right audio. You need to actually get an extender cable that has three rings on it that actually matches your cable. You do that and it works just fine. It's very simple. Um, they're like five bucks. They're really super cheap. You can go to your local store. They're really easy to spot. All you got to do is check the tip, make sure it's got three rings on it and it should work. Normally when they're in packaging, it's a clear package and you can see it no problem. And if you still have any questions, just ask them, you know, whoever's running the store at that time. I, I suggest maybe going, if you're not going to get it online, go to like a store that, you know, you know, I went to like a Radio Shack. A Radio Shack actually just opened up in my local mall. They went out of business and they actually came back. It's privately owned now. So I went there and I explained the situation to him. And he's like, yep, you need the one with the three rings because they're channels. So it works fine. It was only five bucks and now I got perfect voice chat on my Nintendo Switch. And it's pretty exciting. It only works for Fortnite right now. If I want to play Splatoon 2 or something like that, you got to use Nintendo's funky app and all that business. But uh, now that you can actually do it on Fortnite, Nintendo... There's no more excuses. We want to see this on every game now. There's Now that we know you can actually do it and Epic made it possible, let's go ahead and fix voice chat and make it the way it should be. So yeah, if you're watching this video and you can't get your mic to work and you're using an extension cable, make sure you look at the tip of that and make sure it's got three rings on it and you should be good to go. That's pretty much all for right now, guys. Just want to make this short video to maybe help somebody because I was wondering why mine wasn't working. Once I figured it out, I was like, you know what? I want to share the love, spread the message, pass it on. And that's pretty much all for right now, guys. And there'll be more to come shortly. Thanks again.